My name's Ben Gamzer and we're at Cotswold Vets. So my wife and I started the place five years ago, a little small animal veterinary practice. Um, and back then it was just the two of us and two nurses. Um, it's grown over the years and we're now at eight vets and 11 nurses. We've doubled this reception space, um, doubled the number of consult rooms, uh, provided quite a lot of um, kit and prep space um, for sort of laundry um, sterilization. Uh, and also then added a second theatre, which we um, use more specifically for um, orthopedics and, and, and endoscopy, um, and uh, a specific dental operating theatre uh, that's allowed us to move the dental x-ray there as well and, and uh, minimise the uh, amount of um, patient transfer under uh, anaesthetic. Um, and also then a, a sort of second floor that includes um, some uh, staff amenities, a nice staff room and uh, office um, and a bit of storage space and some locker space and changing space. To be able to keep uh, an interest in, in a certain specific area uh, requires you know, enough patience to be able to um, uh, indulge in that. So uh, there's definitely a size whereby uh, you have a, a little bit more um, exciting things to do on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, and for us, I think that's probably come at about you know, three or four full-time vet equivalents. We very much concentrate on providing a, a uh, you know, a grade A service and, and uh, I've always wanted to have, in essence, um, too many vets per client, in, in, you know, in business terms, um, to make sure that they're getting the customer experience that, that realistically we, we all as vets would like to give. Uh, we've got some uh, uh, clinicians with interest in cardiology, uh, ophthalmology, surgery, endoscopy, uh, orthopedics, medicine, um, so uh, really a, a, a dentistry, you know, a, a, a lots of different um, areas that people enjoy practicing the best of their capabilities. Uh, there's times at which um, clearly uh, have been difficult, um, times at which stress levels have been through the roof, and there's times at which um, you know, enjoyment and satisfaction levels have been very high as well. Um, as we were talking about earlier, there's a lot of pride in, in my team and how they're um, coping with it all and, and we've had the luxury of cherry picking them from, um, from the start and that's been a really massive plus for us um, to have people on board that believe in what we believe in um, and, uh, and continue that you know, clinical experience and, and the customer journey. Uh, the joys of a single site practice means that um, everyone is here to provide those extra services without all of the uh, headache of having multiple branches. People say, well, wouldn't you rather have been a doctor? And actually, no, I don't want to sort of operate on people's ankles all day long. For me, that sort of subsectioning would get very boring so uh, that's what I think we're very lucky to achieve is, is that real breadth of experience and exposure and that you know, ability to push into so many different things with the right interest and, and um, reading and, and clinical competence to be able to take new experiences forward.